Guys, welcome back to another video. Jam here, bringing you the next episode within my Leicester City Grimmer Challenge on FIFA 16. This is episode 3 of season 2. Uh, in the last episode, we made a signing from Schalke, Lemonin Lemansane, I think his name was Sarne, well, Sarne from Bordeaux, Schalke, Bordeaux even. Um, we made him a permanent signing here at the club. We're still waiting on some other options. Remy needs to come, we need Remy to. Remy's contract to be sorted out. He wants to see what's crucial first team player, which I'm hoping he can become. If we can get rid of, not that I want to get rid of anybody, to be honest with you, but correct changes have to be made. West Bromwich Albion is the first game of the third of this episode. And what have we got? Nothing. Okay, right, okay, so that's fine, that's fine. We can, let's have a look at the team. I'm going to go, I'm going to go with a Still waiting on an attacking couple of attacking players. We still need a CDM, which I might have to have a look at in a moment after this after this match. Uh, let's go four four two diamond. Um, Ardi Ujara, Kante, and Fuchs. Right, Fuchs for uh, where's Morris? Is he Morris isn't even in the team? Uh, Morris Cam. Uh, right, where is? Who do I want? I don't know who I want. Let's get Gray in the team there. Um, Kramaric on the bench. Okazaki's on the bench. Sane's in the team this time. Allsop is in the team. I'm going to give him a go in this game. Um, and let's jump straight into it with this first game. Right then, guys. So the first match of the new season against West Brom. We have Ryan Allsop in goal. Simpson, Sane, Morgan, Fuchs and Kante. Um, Gray. Drink water, Morris, Ashoa, and Vardy as part of the team in a 4 4 2 diamond, I believe it is. I think it was. Um, but as for West Brom, the away side in this game, they have Foster in goal, Gamboa, Jones, Evans, Prognoli, Fletcher, Mac McManaman, Gardner, Morrison, McLean, and Rondon making up their starting 11 in a 4 1 4 1 formation. Uh, we want to kick this season off with a positive start. We get the ball back off of West Brom here, play the ball into a Mares who gets into his shower, and I genuinely thought he was going to score that, and that's the difference. If we went, if we go for Remy and we get Remy, I reckon guarantee that he would probably bury that sort of chance, and that's the difference between the quality of the two players, if you like. But West Brom champion coming forward here, still in the first half. Get a lovely ball played over to McManaman here. Get the ball back into Rondon. Schmeichel is made forced to make a save. And tip the ball over the bar for a corner, which they do actually take. Um, they whip it in, and unfortunately, Evans heads it over. A good couple of chances there for West Brom to take the lead. Fuchs gets played in here, um, running around the defenders into Kante. Lovely turn once he receives the ball. The keeper should make the save. Unfortunately, he doesn't, doesn't quite make it. And... Leicester are now 1-0 up in the opening game of the season. What a turn from Kante. This is lovely bit of play. Did the defender in there, what he was doing. Keeper, you know, we all know he should do better there. Should, should still be 0-0, but 1-0 uh, is the scoreline. Vardy gets played in here into Leonardo Ojoa. Over to Drinkwater, should score this. Foster, forced into an absolutely phenomenal save. Into the second half now, I think it is. Uh... West Brom, I know it's in the first half. West Brom, fantastic chance, recalised there. Couldn't quite take the chance. They come on the attack again, try and score an equaliser. The defending was absolutely shocking. Couldn't select the right player. And near post OP, Mike uh, also has no chance of getting hold of it. And uh, West Brom score an equaliser that we could have so easily avoided. Uh, but unfortunately it's now West Bromwich Albion 1, Leicester 1 at the King Power on the opening day of the season and you'll see from here he just, he, he saw that we left it in the big gap he ran into it and had a, like one of the easiest shots he's ever going to have um, but like into the second half now we get the work easily here we drink water, play into Vardy running around the defence gets a good chance here, runs inside gets taken out definite penalty, you'll see it much much better from the replay uh, but Vardy gets taken out. We have a chance to regain the lead here right at the death. The defender gets a yellow card as a result of that challenge. Uh, Gambara, it was fantastic uh, opportunity for us here. Definite penalty. Got, took Vardy out. Doesn't get any of the ball. And uh, he steps up. 
sends the keeper the right way, but it's a good good goal by Vardy to cross back in front and secure the win and all three points in the game today. And uh, there we go, 2 1. Final result, absolutely fantastic performance. Good couple of good goals on the score sheet as well. Manchester City are next up, but uh, um, after we've gone through some more transfer dead block transfer news, Leicester 2, West Brom 1. Three points. We're going for that title this season, hopefully. And uh, we've started the season in, in the strongest possible manner with a couple of signings. Sane, I must add, played very, very well indeed. Well, guys, that was a 2 1 win. At home to West Bromwich Albion on the opening day of the season. We need to kick off the season brilliantly. And, and added news, Loic Remy has accepted his contract. And the next step for us, accept him as a Leicester City player. And uh, we have now got an additional attacking option. Now, it's insane because we missed a couple of good chances in that, in that match against West Brom. A few key chances that I would think Remy probably would have buried, uh, to be fair. Uh, we've got Manchester City coming up. I want to have a quick, before we get into that game, I want to have a quick look at a CDM player because when we look at the um, sell player list and put it into position, I don't know what we've got in terms of CDM players. We've got a centre mid. I mean, Drinkwater, Kante, King are the only ones there, and I think we need another one really, to bolster it a little bit. So, let's have a look um, at, let's change the scouting options now. We've got a striker, we don't need, even though any more could do, but let's have a look at mid. Uh, Matic, we could potentially go for him, but then again, 16, we could actually go for Matic, to be fair. Um, and I might actually try it, <laughs> just for to try it. Pop is going to be way too much, as we know. Bezic could do. Pedro, I oh, don't know. What CDM players, don't I? Um, could go for Ramsey, Jack Cork. There's a load of good, decent options. Um, um, that's Valbuena. Decent option, but he's a bit old. Uh... Gabby Adini will be already tried. We know that doesn't work. Imbula could try for, could for him. Uh, mm, interesting. And Tetas left mid and Tep. Canvener. Uh, can can cover. Mavuba. Uh, uh, Honda, right mid. Uh, Polly Salah. Some decent options there. Um, I'm gonna, just just to try it. I'm, I, I I can guarantee Matic won't probably won't want to leave Chelsea, but we're obviously raiding them at the minute, and I don't think uh, actually. Do you know what? I, I, okay, we're probably going to be. Let's just inquire because Matic would be insane, really. Uh, I doubt it, but I doubt we're going to make it, do it. To be fair, but we're going to inquire anyway. Let's set up another a set a different scout instruction. Um, Global Transfer Network instructions. Uh, add new instruction position. Defensive mid. Attributes. Any to be fair, age. Got to be at least, I'd say, 27 or on to 16 to 27. Don't worry, bother about the contract. Uh, defensive minded, aerial threat, uh, first team quality. Uh, uh, yeah, first team quality. Got to be fair. Uh, actually, no, I won't do that. That's just strong, obviously. Actually, let's, go, let's put first team quality on and go with that. Um, and see if we'll get back. Um, we've inquired about Matic. I doubt we'll get anything for him anyway. Um, but we've got Manchester City coming up. Match rescheduled. Not too bothered about that. Got three emails. Right, Matic inquiry. 32 million. Absolutely no way. Absolutely knew it anyway. 
Uh, I mean, we've got what have we got left in terms of transfers? We've got 22 million. So we'll see what we'll see what comes back, but uh, it's pretty interesting to say the least. Um, Remy, we got him in the team now, so that's pretty good. We've got an additional attacking option, which is pretty good. Um, so. Let's just jump straight to the next match against Manchester City and see what happens afterwards. Right then, guys, the Manchester City game. They have Cavallaro in goals. Abaleta, Otamendi, Mangalo and Clichy at the back. De Bruyne, Delph, Lerma and Sterling in midfield. Garcia in cam and then Benzema up front on his own. That new guy, Lerma, don't know who he is, but uh, could be a region. You never know. But we have Schmeichel in goal for this one. This is a big one. Sim Simpson, Sane, Morgan and Schlupp at the back. Kante, Maros, Drinkwater and Gray in midfield. And our new signing, Loic Remy, partnering Jamie Vardy up front. This is being played at the Etihad. Uh, Manchester City come on their first attack with Sterling here. The defending is absolutely shambolic. Gets the ball over here to um, Garcia eventually and just smashes it into the bottom right-hand corner. Schmeichel had absolutely no chance. Ten minutes gone, they get the ball forward. They score and absolutely won the goal. Just didn't know what to do about it. Couldn't do anything about it, to be fair. But they come on the attack again. A really ch close chance to score again here. Schmeichel with the simple catch as a saviour. Uh, we come on our first attack here on the brink of half time. Good chance off the bar by Drinkwater there, I think it was. 1-0 um, one, one to Manchester City at half time. And uh, at half time, I felt Damari Gray didn't do particularly well, so I brought Daniel Amati on to make the defensive option change. Simpson running forward, now the right back, right at the start of the second half, cuts back, finesses it. Oh, what a goal it was. What a goal. I mean, for my right back to do that, to come forward from the right side of the pitch, into the middle, cut back and just finesse it beautifully into the bottom corner is something that is very, very rare. We've got goal scorers across the team, and that is shown over the, over the whole of the first season the ends, and into this one as well. Uh, but Manchester City coming right forward once again here. Very, it, again, the, the, the attacker just, I think it was Ben Zimmer who got up for the initial header off the bar there, but um, Sterling is there to head home the rebound as Schmeichel is diving the other way. Um, so Leicester regain, uh, Manchester City regain their lead rather. And uh, we've now got to fight to make sure we secure a win or a draw out of this one because we can't afford to lose it. But uh, Simpson coming forward now. Lovely bit of play. 30 minutes to go. Cuts inside. Keeps going. Lovely bit of play here. Um, still going. Gets tackled. But we get the ball back here with Kante. Played into drink water. Good chance here. Run, oh, goes on a little bit. Run. Cuts back. Plays it into a Marty. Then plays it into... Or has a shot rather. Can't get the... Rebound as, it, as City get it cleared. Um, Vardy does really well here to get the ball back. Um, cuts back, lovely bit of chance here. Plays it in to Loic. Remy goes on a little bit of a run himself. Gets the shot away, bang. Bottom left hand corner, 2 all. Loic Remy scores on his official Leicester City debut, um, hence the title. And oh my god, absolutely amazing. I was so shocked when. Were an ecstatic when he scored it, but Leicester Manchester City come on the attack once again. And what a finish! Oh my god, Manny Gar I think it's Manny Garcia. I mean, he is literally running the show, running rings around my team. It's now 3 2 to Leicester. He scored some banging goals in this match, and to be fair. Yeah, you could have closed him down a bit better, but my... Yeah, you could have closed him down a lot better, but to be fair, he got that shot away absolutely perfectly. Remy gets played in here, right at the death. We're losing still. Gets it, finds a bit of space and just smashes it into the top right-hand corner. Last minute, last minute equaliser. And it's now three all thanks to Loic Remy. Leicester's new signing. Oh my God, it's absolutely insane. But I just couldn't believe that I'd managed to go and... Be in a losing position on all three occasions and still bring the game back to a draw. I mean, it ended real and that was that. A point away at the Etihad against Manchester City. Remy was scoring two goals. Absolutely fantastic. Well, guys, that three all draw 
against Manchester City at the Etihad means that we uh, potentially climb the league. I don't quite, don't quite know where we are at the moment. Um, but as you can see, we've got a Champions Cup game coming up in August. It's a playoff round and it's Copenhagen. We've got the two legs coming up in the next episode. Um, we are still in the need of a CDM player. Um, and we still think we're still drawing from City means we're going to fourth, uh, into fifth. Sorry. Um, so Copenhagen, uh, we're hopefully going to go up to three games next episode. Um, we've got, got Copenhagen, the first leg definitely, Newcastle, and then possibly the, the second leg, depending on how things go with regarding to transfers. We still need a CDM player. Um, I'm going to quickly advance and see what. I, I don't even know if I've got any other ideas coming through, but. Have we? We've got an email. That's an update from England, right? Let's see what that has. These updates from, England, these updates from countries can give us a chance of what. see what's happening. Um, okay. Midfielder, anybody? Yes, right. So I haven't got any CDM. Saviet looks decent. Um, Sessignon, Cam, Matic, we also already know about. Wanyama. Wanyama, I didn't think of him. I'm tempted. I'm, I'm, I'm tempted to go with Wanyama. We haven't got his overall. Uh, let's just scout him quickly. Let's just... I don't even care. He's, he's, he's good enough. Uh... No, I'm not actually. I'll, 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 um, I'll inquire, and then we'll find out what's going to happen with Victor Wanyama in the next episode, where our Champions League campaign kicks off a month earlier than expected. Thank you very much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Three matches. Go. We'll hopefully go back up to three matches very soon, indeed. So don't worry about that. But thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one very soon, indeed. See you later.